In this case, a picture is not worth a thousand words. In fact, it's left us at a loss for them. These photos are just leading to more questions than answers. Jamie Edmonds tells us about a discovery of an old photo album in Wixom that has the police there shaking their heads. Here is the album in question found earlier this week. Family photos dating back to 1950 and police want to get it back to its rightful owner. January 18th, 1950. Looking through the album, you can see there are clues, like the name Kim Leanne Kowalski. This appears to be her baby book. There are also places written down, like Georgia, Arizona, and Alaska. I have reason to believe that perhaps Ms. Kowalski's family was in the military, because there's one photograph that shows, looks like a barracks, and there's a sign on it that says Major Kowalski. That's Wixom Police Chief Ron Moore, who says he was immediately intrigued the minute the album was dropped off at the station. It was found at Char on Charms Road, west of Wixom Road. Moore says he did some good old-fashioned police work, but nothing came back for that name in this state, even though there is a reference to Potter Road. Well, we have a Potter Road here in Wixom. I I'm hoping that someone will say, well, I know the Karofsky family. They, they, their cousin lived over on Potter Road or, or something of that nature. I'm, I'm hoping to be able to get this into the hands of a family member. That's when the police chief went to Facebook, asking for the public's help. Local 4 did some digging today, too. No birth records in Oakland County for Kim Kowalski, but we did find a person with that name in a sorority at University of Arizona. We also found a wedding announcement with that name. She married Robert Sawyer Williams in 1972, according to the Tucson Daily Citizen. But that's as far as we've gotten. Chief Moore's Facebook has been viewed nearly 7,000 times and shared 100 times. He hopes word gets around to anyone and everyone, then hopefully the right one. I look forward to getting in Monday morning and checking my voicemail. I'm, I'm hoping that a cousin or a daughter or a grandson is in my voicemail saying, that's, that's my family member's photo album. If you know Kim Kowalski or her family, Wixom police say give them a call. Would love to have a happy ending to this story. In Wixom, Jamie Edmonds, Local 4. Yeah, I think, you're, I think Basil will get out of that crib. <laughs> yeah. uh, we reached out to the sorority in which we found uh, a Kim Kowalski, Tau Beta Sigma Omega, at University of Arizona so far. No response, but perhaps we have a sorority sister in the audience watching right now. We'll put their number on clickondetroit.com. Hopefully somebody knows something, because you can bet that a Those family member would treasure them. Yeah.